Hey cousins, it's your favorite cousin in the world. Don't call me white girl here again to tell you about my subscription. If you go to moremona.com today, you can subscribe to my podcast and get extra bonus episodes. That's right. We give out extra episodes. We give out exclusive BTS that you can't see anywhere else. But my favorite part of the subscription, hands down, would have to be the Discord. Discord is like a big group group cousin chat where we in there doing all kinds of things. I don't think I've really explained the Discord enough. Discord um, is so many different ways that you can chat. You get in there. It's kind of like a family vibe, a little bit of camaraderie. Everybody has this one thing in person me um and everybody just chatting building their own relationships building their own bonds and shit um for sure i seen some girls doing some like uh lose weight get fit group and um how to save money group and all that i stay away from all that i just stay in the main groups where we talk a lot about sex and we exchange pictures X-rated ones. Join Mormona.com today. You can either pay $6.99 monthly or you can take the big dive and pay $59.99 so you don't have to worry about um, resubscribing or making sure you're missing any, missing out on anything, any information, any um, exclusive content or anything. So go to Mormona.com today and at least check it out. See if you want to join. And um, when you do join, tap in on Discord. Say what's up to the kid. I'm always there 24-7. I live in the Discord. Everybody knows it. Mormona.com. Hi. Oh, the merch is available. Go grab. At breakbeatmerch.com. Anything you wanted that you saw on tour, you saw me and Phelps or Tom wear, you can get it right now. Right here, show. Do you want to run those kind of people? <laughs> All right, girl. All right. <laughs> Just tapping in. Um, I'm super excited. Um, Everything looks a little different today. Phelps is in the building. Phelps, yeah, roll out all the way from the back. Phelps is in the building, but I know I told y'all I was in a movie, my first movie debut. I'm super excited. Um, the coolest part is I'm in a movie with a bunch of Philly <laughs> I respect and got love for the things they do, so I was real excited to bring y'all them, so you better be appreciative. And if you want passes, like phone numbers and all that, we can work that out. You got to hit my cash app first, and I'll <laughs> lead you in the right direction. Work but let me out. introduce everybody um, just from how they sit in. First, we got Boom. Yes, up. Oh, y'all should introduce yourselves, right? Y'all probably yeah, recognize I'm somebody. Like, introduce yourselves because I don't work for nobody. Well, I'm, what camera I'm looking at? I'm Boom yeah, who, 39. Yeah, where's your camera? Boom 39 on Instagram. I'm They're... Southside Jew. You already know who I am. <laughs> Damn, Rich. <laughs> Damn. Rich had the coolest drawing, <laughs> though. Let me uh, shut up. Yeah. You already know what they're going on. It's everybody's favorite. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah. If y'all don't know, the movie is um y'all drawing. Um it drops August 16th. They can watch it where exactly AMC Theaters. AMC Theaters. We, we coming gonna, we out. Gonna, we're gonna drop the locations um probably later on this week on Instagram. Okay. Okay. They probably start us off with like three to four locations. Yeah. We'll see how we do with that. Yeah. As far as watching it at home, though, when did it get to the point where they watch it at home? What is what is like a um? What is that? September. Like September? Nah, no, they, they said three. They said ninety days. days. That's yeah. three months. Yeah. Okay, so from so August. That's September, October. So y'all got to come to the theaters. Yeah, bottom yeah, line, yeah, you got to come out and watch it. Yeah, I'm super excited. Um, I I don't really know how to say it, but I I play a police officer in it, and um. <laughs> uh, it was, it was, you know, I had to really get into the character. I had to, you know, dig from somewhere else because nothing about me gives police. Um, even though at least I was like FBI, like I wasn't like no dirty, like, you know, like yeah. WPD, fill up. You I know thought, what I mean? I thought like, the role was perfect, though. It was, it I was. guess, because I was spicy. Because yeah. when you, the, yeah, when you read the, um, what is it called? Description or prescription? I think I'm going to the uh, pharmacy. <laughs> 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 what is it? <laughs> yeah. huh? I know. I'm talking about the description. description. Yeah, the description. yeah. He tired. He worked out this morning. The, <laughs> the um description is 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 you see you. Yeah. But it but I, we put you on the fair side. But it's a lazy um federal agent. Like, okay. You don't want to lie. I'm it not chasing. Like exactly. That's me. Yeah, no, girl. Because when I'm reading, it, it's like 
Y'all know I don't act. I've never acted. It's my first time, really. Like, I've done reality television, but I've never done, like, scripted stuff. But when I'm reading it, I'm, like, looking at it, like, like it just get a little intimidating because I never did it, right? But boom, giving it to me, like, you look f- I'm like, oh, that's it. Like, okay, I got it. You feel me? But it's a real Philadelphia production. Yeah. Love Philadelphia. This, you going to get some Philly out of this one. But this is just second go round. Yes, yes. The first yes. movie is... The Bid. The Bid, yeah. The bid uh, right now, movie. um... What is it? Tubi, Amazon Prime, Apple mm-hmm. TV. Uh-huh. Yeah, on yeah. all platforms. Dope prison comedy, um, featuring all the um, social media comedians. Yeah. Like, but this time around, you know, new, up and coming, and people that's popping. Yeah. Before we had Hi Hi Davis and Southside You and Tiz. Now yeah. we got you, Meatball. Funny. Still Southside You ish. Like it was funny just, doing it. That's how yeah, you know it be yeah. funny. It was rolling doing it. Right. Yeah. And I like the fact there was so much weed on set. Like yeah. I really enjoyed that. Because yeah. I was relaxed. Because <laughs> it's scary. Y'all, I guess because y'all used to. But when them cameras get in your face and it's a white Because like, you know white boys always getting them weird like body right. positions. Right. Have a yoga pose. His knee up a little yeah. bit. Like eyes up. Like okay. Uh, I just need you yeah. to just run that back again. It's right. kind of like oh. This is a real thing. Oh, yeah. Right. Me and Rich see you nervous. Hey, that's an extra 20 minutes. We got to wait, man. Yeah. yeah. You need to go relax. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Get yourself together. Yeah. That's yeah. She said that because my man Boom was talking. We was talking and you was like the most unnervous, most yeah. professional person out of the whole cast. Yeah. Literally. Thank you. We talked about that wow. a lot. Oh so my God. Nah, nah, nah. Like when she came on, I've been you ain't lied. To, I've been lied on so much in my career. Wait a minute. I've been lied on so. I mean, no, no, motherfuckers no, no, no. got on the internet and said no, no, no. I. I didn't come to work. I was late. I was horrible. And but this black man to just be honest, I really appreciate yeah, and it. And you got off on. You got. You came and you got off on time. You know, you, you shot five or six scenes in two days. That's you feel oh, me? Man, that's dope. Jump right in the yeah, road. That's dope. I ate donuts in the morning. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. I was looking through the gram just like writing names down. You feel me? <laughs> oh, the just grabbed. He got a couple pounds just to get like in that mold. Yeah. I really. You know, we we understand the culture. Right. So when we tell you two, we already know we shooting at five. Yeah. Right, 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 right. <laughs> So you think you running there? Actually, you a half early. <laughs> we, we, we real bad. I ran in. We understand the culture. <laughs> That's real. Yeah. Right, listen, that's real. Why don't everybody do that? Don't that make sense? Perfecto. Whatever. That's so simple. That's so simple. So look, in your in in y'all drawing, basically, it's like um the 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 uh what's that fancy movie word? Jet left jet. What's the what's the fancy movie word for like the aggressor in the movie or the villain? Antagonist. Okay, mm-hmm. Mr. College. <laughs> the antagonist in this movie is the Park Apes, correct? And y'all yeah. Park Apes. Mm-hmm. That's why I want to know what did y'all do in the movie, like how you feel about it? Because both of them are comics. They being a little quiet. I'm sure y'all recognize. I mean, if you don't, I feel like you can't walk around with them white lips and a mother- <laughs> forget who you is. You feel me? But you you put your brain in. <laughs> now I'm. Yeah, you ain't. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, <laughs> but no. Tell them a little bit about y'all stuff, Jew and Ish. Tell them a little bit about y'all stuff and what y'all did in the movie. So, um, you know, for y'all drawing, we I'm a part of the Park Eats. That's a gang. Me, Meatball, um, uh, Molly Cobain, uh, and a few others. We're going and Honey Buck, right? Two cheers. Where Where's Molly? Me? Hey, I should have called. Oh, he had a, I just seen him on the ground. He looked like he was dancing at somebody's damn event. Oh, okay. He okay. had an event. No, I'm only at work. He had the days in. Oh, yeah, at work. Yeah. Okay. He had the days in. He said he probably on live right now sweeping. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Ain't no shame in Molly game. Yeah. It work. They run that hotel. Yeah, so what you doing on the movie? Like, do you, you did you do like all script? You freestyle as a comic, like how was the whole thing? It was, it was more so like, uh, so you, see, Boone, he knows uh, all the comedians, like, like he knows our characters and us down to the T. So 
even if you're not funny, he can make you funny. Mm -hmm. So he wrote, he knew how to write for each person and each comedian. So basically, I was. Oh, oh you really wrote these parts yeah. for us. Yes. Yeah. So I think it's right. And then go, you know what? Put you right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Right, that's right. Somebody, like that. Let's think about it. Somebody really wanted back. you, um, wanted you to go help them. Like I wouldn't even waste my time with them. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. That's you. Yeah. That's why we. That's why we say get smart, yeah. but do you? That's but you, you right. can say so what you. you we should have had a scene with me beating. <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> but go ahead. Did you finish what you were saying? Yeah. So you know. Um, Boom, you know, he writes he writes for anybody. So uh it just was basically like uh he got me down pack. Sometimes I freestyle some stuff, like he'd be like, go with the flow. But he got we're rapping on this movie. Are right? you? Yes, we're rapping. Yes. Like battling? Oh like, no, like they oh they drill. Rappers. Oh, that makes so much sense. Okay, y'all thugged out drill rappers. Okay, yeah. That's funny. To me. We 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 back and back rapping okay. with each other. Okay, okay, yeah. Everyone's favorite is back. Kiki Palmer's podcast is back and it's too good. She has questions for days and now she's diving into the brains of entertainment's best and brightest to get some answers. From Snoop Dogg to Jordan Peele to Quinta Brunson to John Stamos to Amy Poehler, Kiki is getting to the bottom of the burning topics that keep us up at night. If you love Kiki Palmer, you'll love Baby. This is Kiki Palmer. She's her most authentic self going all in on everything in her life in the lives of her celeb guests. Follow, watch, and listen to Baby This Is Kiki Palmer on the Wondery app or wherever you get your podcast. And now watch full episodes on Kiki's own YouTube channel. Listen to Baby This Is Kiki Palmer early and ad free right now by joining Wondery Plus. Yeah, because I look. that is right, because I do the um one of the trailers, um, Meatball. I'm from the north side of Philly. Yeah. When I see him such and such, and I'm a killing. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny as <laughs> I'm hype. I'm excited. Right, 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 right. Yeah. The other funny part of the trailer that had me rolling, that's what I'm saying. The trailer just made me excited because it's like you doing it, you don't really know how it's going to play, but the trailer really made me laugh. Yeah. And then it's a couple of them, they all funny, and then just seeing how people react to them because everybody's excited. Everybody want to see it. Right. And um, uh, people was comparing it to it's going to be the next Paper Soldiers. But I said, I feel like they said that about the bid after it came out, like that was going to be the next Paper Soldiers. But I, it is that Philly classic comedy thing. You know what I mean? Because what did we have before that? State Property 3? Like it wasn't two. It wasn't supposed to be a joke. But that's the only thing was like cackling at. You feel me? But um, what was I talking about? What was I talking about? You was talking about the trailer. Oh, the other part from the trailer that I thought was funny was... um. Um, some point Boone saying something because I think he got asthma or something, but he says oh, the complete my ex <laughs> yeah, <laughs> me rolling. I'm like <laughs> hey, it was funny. Cause Boone is a comic is. too. You I know I'm old. I'm old too, Mona. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I ask people all the time what I was just saying. Yeah, it's, it's he not. did that too. No, at least y'all nah. know how to As soon as you hit thirty, it's yeah. so bad they even know. Like I be doing that like, we did a live podcast. And I say to the audience, and they tell me, like, you said, did, 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 because they know I do it all the time. You can't whole do episode. that with Rich. We, I be talking, I say, Rich, what I say? He said, I don't know. Be he laughing. wasn't listening. <laughs> <laughs> y'all brothers, right? No. Nah, I thought y'all were brothers. Calvin Cat introduced us. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. We, um, for, um, we did Watch Tussie. Okay. Girl, that thing, don't know why Tussie. <laughs> <laughs> this is after... Uh, um, you're Pitt. hurt. You're yeah, hit. I don't know if y'all know when that came out. Oh, when you met him. How long was you locked up? Eleven years. Okay, welcome back. How long you been home? Eight years. Oh, you doing your thing? You done made a movie. I know that's right. Y'all come home from jail. Snapping you wallow. Things is changing. Niggas usually come from jail. Get a little house. This dope, this dope stuff. A drug dealer come home and get four houses and rent them out. Real shit, I'm, it made me want to go to jail. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I'm about to go to jail, come back like wallow, fuck it. <laughs> Running up to the camera. <laughs> That's funny as shit. Yeah, where you was at? The whole 11. So I was in Oliver, I was in Cheeseburg, I was in Baltimore. I did a year at FDC. Yeah. Yes, I like county jails. So I ain't had so past like, two years. Oh, yeah. I did three mm. days at No, it ain't no program. It's it's a hard it's hard time. It's like the county. You had less than five years. You gotta have less than two to be in there. Okay. 
Yeah. Like if you waiting on shit, you might yeah. get stuck. But you know, the feds will put you in that thing in the middle of the country with the big open dorm. Mm-hmm. FDC is more like you really got a case that's in the middle of doing something and they're playing them there for a little bit. But it's not, it's no wreck, it's no nothing. That shit horrible. And the inmates mm-hmm. run to jail, so you have to work. Yeah, so they used to wake me up two in the morning. Yeah, it would have been better. I used to. I wrote them niggas a letter. Please come get was it like me or, was it like and take me somewhere I could further my life. Yeah. Oh, I my can't goodness. get anything yeah. done in here. Was it like Orange is the New Black in there for you? Um, listen, on some real <laughs> shit. No, no. on some real <laughs> shit, Jill. On some real shit. I have never seen a fictional jail show that. I kind of was like, oh shit. You know, like, right. that's the closest. But it was a lot of shit. Like, the IDs was the same. The boots was the same. The right. outfits was the same. You feel me? So it wasn't just, but some of the behavior, yeah, too. Because that's all girl jealous. It's fuck fest. Unless, if it's gangbangers in there, it's different. But if it's just regular bitches, everybody just fucking. All the beef say, stems from fucking. Where, where, can let me ask you something? Mm-hmm. Were you ever gay for this day? I have never fucked with a girl like kids touch nothing out on the street or in jail. No, but if I ever have to go back, then I'm gonna probably lock would in. Would you be the dyke? I'm gonna be the nigga. I'm gonna have braids like you were the I know. Yeah, see and I'm gonna be the I've boy. And I'm gonna have that. a homemade dildo, and I'm gonna wear it all day. I'm not gonna <laughs> just wear it when I hit the bitch. I'm gonna wear it and hold that motherfucker at the microwave because I'm gonna have three, four, five bitches. I'm gonna have five <laughs> lockers on the joint because I'm gonna have five bitches with my locker in there. I had a fucking roommate that really, that's what really made me say, yo, if I ever come back to jail, I'm gonna be a boy. Because I would meet these bitches, they move like boys, go in their right. room. They got five kids on the street, they prostitutes, they crack kids and shit. You feel me? Yeah. yeah. Because, first of all, the feds is covered with DC people because they don't have no upstate jail. So a motherfucker be in jail for prostitution in the feds with you. You feel right, me? Or right. some regular shit. Right. So I was in jail with all kind of people. You feel what I'm saying? And they really, them, them, they be hard as shit. Beards, touch me nots. You can't touch them, eat them, nothing. They act like niggas and they'll have four kids on the street and Damn. foster care, some wild shit. Have a bitch ironing the clothes, waxing the floor. My first celly on 3 North when I was at FDC, that bitch was so lit. I started calling the bitch dad. And I remember I called home and I was on the phone with my, my real dad. My dad did 10 years in uh, Greatest Fair. I was on the phone with my real dad and so I was like, hold on, dad. And I said, yeah, pop, something, something. I got back on the phone. He was like, yo, don't call none of them bitches mom or dad, nigga. You don't do that in jail, nigga. What are you doing? What type of dyke shit you on in there? You don't do that. He going off. Nigga, I just got two pair of sneaks. This is my dad, nigga. Fuck you. Yeah. It's like lit. It's like lit. All I used to have to do, listen, all I used to have to do is put my chair to the door while she fucking bitches. Like, watch out. Because she literally would make this dildos. Said, yeah. She would make dildos. <laughs> Fellas know I got jail stories for that. They would have dildos this big with the strap attachment. Then she would be fucking bitches. She had girlfriends. So they'd be in there, and i watch out, shit like that. That was my dad. Like, we not about to do that. My a couple dad, step yeah. You got me yeah, fucked up. Money. She was so lit. That bitch was rich. That's when we first met. I thought that we was going to beef because she's like, look, young buck, I need your locker. And I'm like, bitch, you don't need my locker, nigga. <laughs> this bitch like 350. Big, big black joints, just like a man. She's like a big black man. Oh, she was from man. D.C. Damn. And I puffed my chest and she like, calm down. She like, man, <laughs> you tell, oh, you tell, <laughs> calm down. It ain't like that. I'm, we gonna, we we share in here. That's what she said. Uh, so then I would like fight it at first, order my own shit, but it got dumb. I ain't had nowhere to put nothing. You feel what I'm saying? Right. Man, dad, like, dad, let me put these groceries up. <laughs> <laughs> Floors waxed, all that iron clothes, everything. Bitch, come clean our room two, three times a day. I am not playing. They make our dinner, our little chichis made. Oh, that's lit. What? And when I used to make salad, she used to pray to Jesus. That was my nigga. She'd be like, oh, you up doing that pray stuff? Let me pray to Jesus. Only thing she'd be loud and shit. I'd be thinking, shut the fuck up. She's trying to compete. <laughs> this is really how you make salad. She's trying to compete. <laughs> Lord Jesus. I'm like, bitch, you throwing my shit off. Real shit. No. Yeah, but it's so weird how you felt. You felt like you um you got the freestyle on some comedian shit. I want y'all to really say I've been a comic this long. I started like this, I started like that, but I'm not gonna walk you down the street. All right. Talk to you. I've been doing comedy since 2009 because it's been a game. I thought it had been seeing that when I came out on the time. 2009? Yep. Oh, you're a real comedian. Yes. Probably. 2017. I've been going when you start getting the internet presence. 2017. Okay. 2017, I think that was 
Shout out to Tiz. Shout out to Tiz, man. Yeah, shout, definitely shout out to Tiz. Put me on the match, put me on a lot of stuff. Like, you know, Tiz, like, don't nobody make me laugh. He's like, bro, you make me laugh. Yeah. Facts. And I'm like, damn, for real? Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet, nigga. And then I just start showing myself. Right. And I start snapping and everybody start tuning in. Yeah. We went to school together all our life. Did y'all? Yeah. Yeah, he's been doing comedy before me. I just you from South Philly too? Yeah, you yeah, from South Philly too. Y'all from South Philly? Oh, yes. You rich oh, and boom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh, you from yeah, Uptown? I'm from the bottom. Well, you from West Philly? Yeah, we used to live right around the corner from each other, you know. Because he was. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Finish what you were saying. He from the P though. I was talking about location. <laughs> when he when Boom first came out, because Boom was famous, y'all was famous before me. And um Papa Perk was like the biggest thing or whatever, but your right. Instagram was rolling at the same time. You could yeah. do daily skits because you would always record your baby boy and he was funny as shit. Mm, Get the fuck Malachi, out of my face. Shout yeah. Out to yeah, shout out to Malachi. <laughs> I used to love Malachi, little handsome chocolate ass. But he when I was following you and I would see the background, you lived across the street from me because I lived on 39th and Lancaster, like on the other yeah. side. You lived yeah, on the other side with that. I was down the bottom for years. I, was I remember. Thirty nine Oh, see, that's crazy. I ain't know. That's like yeah. this is old though. This is like 2015, 14, like that old. You know, that's old. Yeah, 2014, 15. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 12, yeah. I don't know, but yeah, I moved because I'm from North Philly. You know, usually we don't cross town. We don't do that. But it was like a free house situation, so I lived down the bottom for a little I bit, so and I like, turned that shit up. Where, where I don't like to like. Like near the bar okay. or Okay, or? if you know that area, it's the police station, but then it's the mm-hmm. little block. That's where everybody shoot dice. That's where everybody, I live right. right on the little block okay. where you shoot dice at. That's okay. exactly where my house was. It used to be full of niggas in that house, all men. Because the family, there's a big family in there is my mom. But you ain't going as family. far as Barron. It's Sloan. Yeah, it's right there. It's yeah. Barron, Sloan, and then Willow Street. It's okay. called Willow Street. It's okay. literally Willow. a tiny he block. It ain't no Lancaster? park. Like right now. Oh, I ain't about to behind. say. I know, I know you. Exactly so the real time. bottom this way, University City this yeah. way, I'm on that side. That neighborhood was nice as shit. Because yeah. there's a project right behind the... Uh, uh, there's a project right behind uh, Lancaster, too. What, like 41st Street or something? Yeah, all them, you know what I'm saying? I know what you're talking what, 40th about. 40th and Market? That's yeah. the townhouses. Yeah, yeah they no, townhouses. Right here on... Um, Forty from Barron. Where I go get a breakfast store at? <laughs> on thirty. What's that like? Like thirty nine. I don't think that's Haverford. No, that's not Haverford. No, We're Texas Wiener is Lancaster Avenue. I know that. Where are you talking about? That. You talking about it between Texas Wieners. Texas, Texas Wieners is so right overrated. Texas Wieners. Yeah, it's before Texas Wieners. I it's said like, it. It's right on the same. Texas block Wiener is overrated. Spot. I said Jamaica it. Jamaica Hut. It's some shit down the bottom, but it's overrated. There? There's a the little mini project behind it. I feel like oh, yeah. I seen it. Oh, it's yeah. tiny. Okay, okay, okay. Behind the stores okay. is a project. It's probably. Yeah. I ain't never. Yeah, I know exactly. It's little, they little projects. And they used they, to always yeah. shoot that motherfucker yeah, up when yeah, I lived around never, there. Um, they come to the avenue project, to hustle. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, that shit gonna, used to be night and day. Oh, yeah, that's behind the yeah. um, Olympian sports. Yeah, exactly. That yeah. neighborhood night and day. Because when I first went down there, I only seen it university side. I try to go through North Philly. I seen the upside. I said, oh, this is the black bottom. Right. I ain't know. Because yeah. I ain't from, I used to get laws down there. I ain't know about no It West gets Philly. nicer now as you walk up. It got so nice. But I had a South yeah. Philly run. You know where I used to hang at? 24th and Reed. And, yeah. y'all, and then y'all killed my Ran best corner, friend. Yeah. Y'all killed my best friend. Yeah. Shem Shadeen Colleen Johnson. Cookie son. Damn. He's tatted on me, Shem. That was my best friend. Yeah, baby by my cousin. We yeah. could be right there at the park. South Philly, I know bro. What you're talking about. They killed him on the block and dragged him somewhere else, but he really what killed him on the block. Uh huh. Yep. That's messed up, mm-hmm. man. Do you know how y'all get down? <laughs> South Philly's South nasty Philly work. Is na- and that's back when it was like crazy. Nasty Time work. you was in third grade, boy. I'm talking about 2004, 2005, 2006. I was on 24th Street. Stop playing. I'm an older nigga. I'm so serious. Them was the first niggas in the city to wear slim clothes. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. First niggas to wear small shirts and small jeans. Yeah. Niggas was still wearing big shit half a year after that. I don't care what nobody say. I'm telling facts. I was there. Was South Philly's years. always been very stylish. We got to give it to them. No, 0405. Niggas was wearing slim shit. And let me tell you, the only place, other places you've seen it, Jim Jones. They was the Facts. only people doing that. Facts. Jim Jones in South Philly, I don't care what nobody say, and then they caught on. And then everybody got super skinny, like right now, your dick balls is hanging together. <laughs> you know? Facts. Yeah, me and you went to school together, you know, I used to always put everybody in. <laughs> <laughs> he was much bigger than that. He came down. I'm yeah, he used to be chubby. Yeah, yeah, y'all saw, y'all saw old pics of you? Mm-hmm. I followed you forever. Hey, I was big as yeah. my mom. You was my nigga. Yeah. 
This not your first time acting though, huh? Um, in the movie. Oh, okay. You well, I did a lot of movies this summer. Okay. This is, is my favorite. I'm in like seven movies this summer. Damn. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't care about it. Yeah. Because I be doing all the time. Mm-hmm. You know, wounded rich, like they give me a chance. So, you know, every time they yell action, I make sure I put blood, sweat, and tears into it. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Every time they yell cut, you always crack it up. When your birthday? Of course, you are Leo. Mm, of course, you are Leo. I never even thought about comedy. You are real Leo. I asked you on set, boom, but I want to ask you again. Um, hopefully, you say the same thing. What made you go from because you making videos on the internet and shit, and they're funny. Like you was funny and shit when you was on that. That you was funny, and um, you making your videos, and then you end up making a song. The song go fucking crazy, like mm-hmm. real life crazy. It's a fucking remix with French Montana on it. Like we gotta, like come on, you feel me? Yeah. So what makes you go from that to making movies? Because I felt like you kind of felt not like you kind of like. Seem like you like upgraded, like you don't do the internet movies things. I'm gonna sell you a movie, that type of vibe. Oh, like how they have stealing my skits and stuff. Bro. Stealing your skits. Yeah, that sucks. So I definitely stopped doing like, like all the skits and start putting in the scenes. <laughs> Nigga steal your skit bro, and get I, more views than I was you. I'm doing music first. Oh, you was? You was a yeah, rapper yeah, first. Yeah. I, I got stuff in twenty ten with um Waka Flocka and Gilly. What? Yeah, all back then. Um You didn't drop the mixtape with Gilly. And then I um start doing uh when, when Instagram did the um fifteen second joint. Yeah. That's when I started doing the skits. Okay. Like my first five skits with um skits went viral. Yeah, your first five? That's crazy. Like That's my first crazy. five joints. Then the movies, me and my cousin Ralph did a joint. And like, uh, what was that, 2012, something like that? We was going yeah. to sell them DVDs. Yeah, it was selling them Jones. And then after that, just skits. My son was born in 2012. Malachi. Started doing little skits with him. And then Papa Perk in 2015. That shit was huge. And that started off as a skit. Oh, did it? Yeah, remember, um, what was that? The boy, ooh, why you lying? Uh, yeah, why you lying? Yeah. I was like, yeah, dude, I'm coming up with it. And then he came out with that joint. We copying it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He really copy, but I was like, no, nah, I'm going to come up with my own joint. Yeah. And then I came up with the 15-second um, Pop a Perk joint. And, and it went and crazy. Post, it. Oh, she did. Yeah, and Damn, I was like, no, nah, wait till y'all hear the real song. I'm bluffing, but I really can rap. Yeah. So I'm like, all right, let me get back in the lab. Went to go, um, that is I crazy. Went down a diamond cuts joint and laid it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. that's crazy. And Derry, how man, Rich? I used to watch Rich on MTV Jams. What the fuck was you doing? On MTV? <laughs> <laughs> she said, how the fuck was you on MTV Jams? <laughs> we sitting here talking, I don't know what I gotta do. We just went in the what Instagram fuck? era. You tell me, nigga. I used to rap like from 99 to 03 before I was. Okay. But I really didn't rap because I was more in the streets and in and out of town. I was like, you know, out of town type of yeah. back and forth type of nigga like that. Yeah. So I started doing like little freestyles and rapping and stuff like that. And I actually got a buzz like Kev yeah, that started playing my freestyles for like a year straight. Let me find. What so if I, I know one of them? With different rappers. What's your rap name? Filthy Rich. Filthy, Filthy Rich. Rich. That sounds familiar like a I motherfucker. Song, if you hear the song, you're going to know exactly yeah. what I'm talking so about. I started getting a little, but I never took it serious. Like, I never really uh, considered myself. That sounds so familiar. Now it's stuck in my head. Like, who the fuck? So I'll be out of town for like three weeks, and I come back, and I hear niggas ride by playing my freestyle. Yeah. I, I, wanna, I did a record with uh, Nori, with Styles P, with Kendrick Lamar. That's crazy. Like, different rappers that started doing that shit. And I was like, you know what? I need to get serious about Okay. Okay. Yeah, but, it's slow shit yeah, down. But I never really took the rap stuff serious. Yeah. And I started taking it serious, and then I got it back. Damn. Damn. So, it was just You know, I can spit myself. <laughs> you know? Nah, I, I, it's a running joke I got that, um, Everybody from Philly raps, like, as I would say, oh, everybody from Philly raps. My grandma even raps. People would still say, oh, your grandma still rapping. <laughs> like, it's not literal, but we really rappers. Like, everybody Thanks. rap or think they can rap or whatever. Thanks. I mean, I feel like everybody get high, get fucked up, and try to freestyle, <laughs> but Philly niggas got a composition book. Like, oh, we, yeah. we, we, right. we tried it. So we, That's <laughs> all we know. Everybody tried it, and at one point, everybody took it serious, whether it was for a week or a month. You think we crazy? Yeah. Nah, I think y'all dreamers, but that shit is cool. And it's, I don't, 
Like with people, people that can see past like where they around or what they from and see bigger than that. That's a special thing because everybody can't see that. That's and y'all know that because sometimes when you share your dreams, people they say, "What the fuck are you talking about?" Right. And it's yeah. not they don't they don't dislike you or not love you. They just motherfuckers is afraid to fail. And people are afraid to succeed too. So a person to be scared so much for them to fail to be scared that you gonna fail too. Motherfucker, really be you can't like bro. Don't even think yeah, that thing. You know, mad that you ain't scared to fail. Yeah. A lot Niggas of get mad. Not, Some a lot people, of people do. Not even it's, it's rough. God, bro. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Like a lot of people don't have a relationship with God. So how, if you ain't got a relationship with God, you ain't doing nothing in life. You don't feel like nothing. You might nothing think something gonna major is going to happen or something. I like that things move when you take care of things you create. Mm -hmm. Like I noticed when I was going through it with my baby mom and I wasn't doing for my, my young boy, mm -hmm. nothing good happened for me. Yeah. In life. Mm -hmm. And when I did, I said, dang, that's what it is. Yeah. You got to take care of what you create and have a relationship with God. Mm -hmm. And you got to also do the shit mm -hmm. and not be scared to fail. I felt a lot. I seen you fail before. Mm -hmm. We yeah. all fell yeah. before, you know what I mean? But uh, we fell in front of people. Yeah. yeah. But we ain't, it's, it ain't the fall is to get back and don't lay there. That's yeah. All. Yeah. Me, I just love to hustle. I love turning something to something. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's all of our story. Yeah. Right? Just turning nothing to something. Yeah. That, that, that process of doing that is what I really love. So whatever happens at the end is what happens, but I just love that right there. Yeah. Right. That's just the hustle with the with the music. Yeah, that's cool. We, we just, we just got so on. deep. We just got so deep. I don't right. know if I'm higher or did we just get deep. Yeah. Did we just get shit? Just get deep in here. <laughs> like, is somebody going to cry at home? <laughs> he gonna add the, he going to add the chair. But you know why? Because that's what Leo's do. That's what Leo's do. <laughs> The smoking it. <laughs> you should be a motorcycle, like like a bike rider type of person. Oh, oh okay, okay. Yeah, I, yeah. You went to jail. You went to jail. Okay, that's good. Yeah. He's smart. He, he always was a smart hustler. Yeah. <laughs> that R and R is special, ain't it? I thought I was gonna get R and R. That's the worst when you think you gonna get it. Hey, everybody, now you gonna get R and R? My first time locked up. What the fuck was the charge? Take wild guess. Percocet. Guess what I'm doing? He jumped the thing to get on the train because it's being low. Like I'm thinking, okay, like it was, it was take a while. I would have never guessed that. You know, when you that. young, you do stuff. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. But Boom, I was at a stage, shit. you know, like everybody trying to figure it out. Mm. Everybody trying to act like they smart. You know, they got the game, but everybody trying to figure it yeah. out. I was at a stage I was trying to figure it out, but Papa Perk jumped off. Yeah, like that. I'm yeah. like, man, my man calling, yo, man, we gonna die. I said, nah, I work at Einstein. Oh, you did? <laughs> and going to the Einstein pharmacy. Just dumb. <laughs> 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 and came, I'm like, man, I'm gonna do this for you. I'm doing shows now. So I'm like, yo, this, I ain't doing it no more. It's the last time I'm gonna do it. And got last caught time, up. Damn. Cops full on Broad Street. Yeah. Broad and I locked me up. 18 hours. They like, no, you gonna get R&R. &R. They gonna... I can see you not uh, getting on on that. But I had Brian McMonagle though. Oh, you did? Yeah, because I, I hired I, I hired Brian McMonagle for my brother. Mm -hmm. So I was already, you already had a rapport. Yeah, a relationship. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. He got me out of there. Boy. But it was it was dumb. R and R, I got off on R and R a couple times. Me too, Joe. I'm yeah, lucky though. I'm I always been a lucky kind of person. Yes. 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 You get R and R more than once. Or if it's not R and R, they just make it unsecured. Right. So it's an amount of money, so they can revoke it. Fine. But it's not. So you're right. You don't really get R and R more than what you'll get unsecured bail more than once. Shut up, nigga. You know sometimes they sometimes they get rid of them for people. Like I remember Montgomery County. 
<laughs> I remember in Montgomery County, they had like a program. If you're poor, they will get rid of your fines. Yes. And we applied for I did. And I didn't pay nothing to them people. I mean, I right. went to Booster Jail. Booster Jail is Montgomery County. That whole jail full of boosters. The whole jail. Dang. Montgomery County, nasty. Like, they know how to hold you and never let you go. Mm, they wow. so rough. The County Montgomery Jersey. County, we would go pay a bell and then they'll say, she got a traffic ticket in Jersey. She can't get it. Like, they just do weird <laughs> shit. And they nutty. Yeah. They don't like uh, uh, out the, of town. The, the, out of yeah, town. Like, why you up here? Like, you know why we up here? This he motherfucker really, sacks really, up he said, oh, he relax, here. Relax, relax, relax. <laughs> These cops out here. Yeah, relax, he driving dude. safe. Yeah, yeah, he know. just driving safe. Put your seatbelt on. Okay. <laughs> Damn, you it's man. safe. <laughs> <laughs> Take four ninety five. Take four ninety five and not um ninety five. But y'all, it be cool. It's cool. All right. Um, we do a segment on the podcast. First of all, thank y'all for coming. I really appreciate it. Thank you for having me. I hope y'all appreciate me bringing four positive niggas. I mean, black men to the TV screen for you. Um, <laughs> and um. <laughs> I want you to make sure you check it out. We're going to make sure we add everybody Instagram names so you can follow everybody and y'all got to watch the movie and then watch it again, stream it at home because I'm in it, duh. Um, but we do a segment on the podcast, Dark, dark Side of the DM. I asked y'all, did y'all have one? If y'all don't, I do. I always have a Dark Side of the DM. But I would much rather one of yours. Okay, I'll tell you mine. Okay. You with the dark and spooky night. <laughs> now I'm scrolling on the gram. I got a DM. Oh, somebody messaging me. But it was the front one. <laughs> 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 hey, tell him, man. I'm tell him. I'm trying to get it out. I'm trying. Tell him. No, no, no. This is some serious shit, though. It was from one of my dead homies. Oh, but shit. Money. Oh, shit. And I'm just in my head. I just came back from the dead. They asked me about that dub. I hold him. It's crazy. But they didn't <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just serious. I had got a DM from one of my homies that had got killed, and the page was asking me for money, and I'm just like, yo, this nigga did. Like, he asked me for money. Right. And then I found out everybody was doing the cash. Oh, okay, they took the that's page. When that first one, uh, they hacked his page and he was yeah. dead. That would have been but spooked me out. Shut up. No, somebody, somebody, that's brought, funny, oh, my man from around my way called me. Somebody, that, when that first kicked off, mm-hmm. it, 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 and, and he called me. I'm like, and niggas from around my way don't call me like that. So he, he like, yo, man, you, you, you need some bread. I know right. what you're saying. I'm mm-hmm. like, no, it ain't me. Like, yeah. what? They said, yeah. what? Yeah. They like, yo, I'm in desperate. I need like a bean. Yeah. Da, 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 da. I'm like, I ain't know what was going on. You know when they really get people good? When they get the jail niggas. Because you know the jail niggas can't get on the ground all day. So if they catch you in the middle, you might really think it's him and send him, you feel me? Send him a cash app thinking he locked up, he exit for money. Uh-huh. That's why you see them jail niggas a post like, yo, I don't call for cash if that's not me. Da, da, da. Instagram's such a scam. Yeah, I don't You can't know even open all on. your DMs because that should have just zapped your shit. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. It's a it's a link that's out now that's been out for like a year. If you open it, because what it does is it directs you to Thank the you. messenger app, and your messenger app is connected to your Instagram, but it take it all at once. Yeah, Anytime um, it say hurry up, open this, don't open it. Yeah. It's simple. You about to make everybody a dumb bun. If I don't know you, it's <laughs> done. It's scary. Yeah. You re-log in, and they be like, it don't show you nothing, and they say your followers is low, and they say, well, do this, that. It go back to when you first started Instagram and started telling you hit these little questions and stuff like mm. re sign up or you ain't got no followers. So what I do, I'll just get off the ground. What? Joe yeah. Biden dropped out of the race. I don't know if I said that on the podcast. Yeah, yeah you did. Joe Biden is done. <laughs> At least I ain't call him Joe Button. He going to the upper he's, room. Because he's sick, Rich. He's probably dying. They, he got so he got cold. At the end of the day, the rules, you have to have somebody from the Democratic Party to run, right? All Everybody in the party knows, everybody everybody knows Kamala can't beat Trump. She cannot beat him, right? So they're going to probably find somebody to fill in for Joe. And she still... No, babe. She, she's not, she, don't, she ain't in the running because she don't... That's not her lane. Who they going to put in? Uh... I don't know. Can You keep saying, Kyrie, you kept saying Shapiro. Was Shapiro... Is he... Is he was, I'm saying, but will he be somebody that he could put in the race? Or you don't really know? It's going to be hard to be 
It's going to be hard to beat them, especially after you getting so shot hard. and doing this. It's we in hard. trouble. I know it's be like policies don't matter or whatever. We're in fucking trouble, oh, nigga. Billions to them again. We in trouble. Biden. But listen, hold on. Forget that. I know you said the dark DM stuff. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry. All right, this is not a dark doing. DM. Let's focus on it. It's right here. I'm going to read it. You don't got to put it to the camera. All right, right so camera. some girl her name, some girl DM'd me, right? Mm-hmm. On my birthday, mm-hmm. January 9th, she said, Happy birthday, Mr. Stink Stink. Love you, daddy. With the And she blew me a kiss. Okay. My girl writes, <laughs> not your daddy, and my wife only calls me that. You be blessed. <laughs> she says, listen to what she say, though. <laughs> <laughs> you said your girl. <laughs> I swear, my girl. Oh. <laughs> I believe it. I believe it. My girl, she got my dick. She in my shit. She from Baltimore. She gonna do what she wanted to. And she answered like she was you, like you supposed to. Shout out to my sister. She from Baltimore. So she answered how you supposed to be. Shout out to the wife, Tamira Big T. Get your liquid lipo. Oh, I appreciate you, Mona. I love you. She's <laughs> so the girl responds, "Fuck you, you funny shape bitch." Oh, she don't know. She's talking to who? Oh, you? She said, "I wrote it." My girl didn't say, "Oh, this is wife nothing." My girl just responds. Not your daddy, and my wife only calls oh, you that. Oh, she's thinking like it's you, right? Because she said it from a mouth. Oh my god! Listen, she says, "Fuck you, you funny shape bitch." Have a horrible birthday. That's not how you show a fan love. <laughs> you, you fucking dweeb. Are you serious right now, broke ass crumb? You didn't even have to reply. That's how you know you're not famous. And another thing, she said, another thing. Fuck that bald headed ass bitch. She <laughs> She not even done with me. Wait. She That's said, how they come. This is what she said. She fucked me up at the end. She said, she said, fuck that bald headed ass bitch. She just blocked your blessings, Buki. Now go to hell. And I hate niggas with hits, hips. <laughs> <laughs> now you be better blessed back. <laughs> I said, wow, I'm just seeing this. <laughs> <laughs> he said, wow, I'm just <laughs> She baked the shit out of me. I see this shit like days later. I said, damn. <laughs> I can't make this shit up, yeah, bro. She ain't even go in there and see what she got to happen, made happen to you. Oh, my goodness. I can't make this shit up, man. They be cussing us the fuck they out. They be cursing us the fuck no, out. They cuss us out. I get cussed out all the time. What? They grind me the fuck out. You dumbass <laughs> bitch. Wow, I'm just seeing this. With your, they call me all types mm-hmm. of shit. You dyke looking mm-hmm. ass nigga. One bitch told me, mm-hmm. bitch, always on the internet talking about you depressed and shit. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. You sad ass bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, and they don't always get me like that. She had me like, bitch. You know what else they do to me all the time? That's why Gil and Wallow fired you. Let me, listen. And listen, and this is what I'll say back. We don't know where you was working at 2020. That's four years ago, bitch. What Taco Bell got to say about you, bitch? You know what they say to me? What job you leave and what do they say about you when you left, bitch? Like, fuck they, you. God say, damn, if I did lose a job, god damn, that's four years ago, bitch. Any bitch, everybody, they always say it. That's why you fat and your bitch a fitness trainer. Oh, and they I, put it together. They fuck me up every time. I be like, I, I hope your mother die. That's the only you thing. Gotta I'm saying, you yeah, gotta I get nasty. You gotta get. Yeah, I get nasty. Because like you can't gonna just keep coming for me like that. Motherfucker was just on my post. I, Cause I said, and I hate to talk about politics, but I just feel like right now you have to. It's, that's just my personal opinion. And um, and it's my platform. I can do what I want with it. But some of them be pissed because it's like be funny, bitch, you know, or don't say nothing. This guy, you you know you dumb and you know you white. Listen how you just believe anything them people tell you and did it and talking all this shit. And literally, it's like 10 different comments. He cussing me out on the same post. I went to his page and seen that motherfucker with them brand new sneaks that don't get dirty because he in a wheelchair. I said, motherfucker, 
I said, yeah. you need to be worried about who's going to give you disability social security and motherfucking food stamps. You keep talking about Donald Trump. You're going to be rolling your ass to the homeless shelter and rolling your ass to the soup kitchen. You need them. You need a Democrat in office more than anybody do. So you can roll the fuck up out of these comments, motherfucker. I said roll 10 times in the sentence. Hey, yo. Because hey, I can't hey, call them a no, you know, I can't say what I want. I just kept saying roll, 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 motherfucker. Damn, damn, damn. Get you on there. Fresh what, ass what was, that, what was that video? When that girl said, um, she said something about her grandma dying or something like that. And, and you was like, I said something about your grandma and your oh, grandma. Yeah. And, 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 and you was like, and your grandma. And you, and you said, on the your phone, grandma. she called me. And you said, your grandma. No, it was, it was, no, it, it no. was like the most crazy. That girl, right, no, that girl is so mad at me still. That bitch made a Twitter to write me. She was like, you know what, you white bitch, you lucky I gave you some views because you corny as shit. You only went viral because you said that shit on that live. A bitch, when I see you, did it because she from Philly, she from the city. But it's like, what the fuck is you talking about? That's what I'm saying. They be tripping sometimes. Yo, you called my grandma a bitch two years ago on live. <laughs> bitch, what you do to me, bitch? <laughs> what you do to me? Bitch. Yo, I please. was looking at that drink. I remember my mouth that shit. Open, bro. I was like, <laughs> you know what's crazy? That weekend I went viral like three times just in the Airbnb. Every time I picked the camera up, that motherfucker went up. I swear to God. Yeah, bye, bitch. You ain't gonna ruin my day. See ya. Y'all got me yeah. fucked up. <laughs> bitch, fuck you. Girl, are you crazy? Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you today and tomorrow. And your grandma too, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. I be, oh, fuck you. Oh, what am I supposed to say? Oh, and then if you listen closely, she says you apologize. She said that. So what the fuck we about to do right now? Yeah. What, you, what you want from me? But the thing about it is I just have not accepted and ingested fame. People just treat you different. They just weird. Like, period. It's like, and I still be trying to relate like we regular, but you got these thoughts in your head about me, so you acting weird. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Motherfuckers are coming to section, then they do a split. Just tripping. They don't know what to do. <laughs> nah, it's, it's crazy. Nah, it's crazy. Like they don't know what, and it's like I'm sitting here, like, damn, who in here? It's you doing this for me, my mind. Right. You on the ground, girl. Get the fuck up. <laughs> and I tell a bitch quick, did she be tripping? I get the come on now, get up. Don't cry, don't cry, cause they be tripping. Um, the girl posted the girl sucking her toe. I can't do that. Like, oh, yeah, I, that I can't. Well, yeah. I mean, call the police. Ah, mm-hmm. That's crazy. Suki, a fan was let a fan suck her too. But they be loving you like that. Like yeah. I know somebody would do that if you mm. know if I yeah, yeah these that's bitches that's suck that's pussy that's if I let them. That's some that's of them. Especially from women, like from women, my wife. I get approached I get by the most beautiful. I went to a show in Texas. The bitch woke up. She looked like a better version than me. This bitch younger, taller, bigger titties, bigger ass, pretty as shit. We look like both got these round white faces, pink lips. When we got close. That bitch was with something so nasty. I took the bitch like this. <laughs> what? She wanted to do something to me. Boy, we the girls gay now. That shit would've. I heard that y'all be. It'd have been looking like she was fucking her before and after. They said they be after kids in a rough life. <laughs> like, bitch, what is wrong with you? <laughs> like, what the fuck? It'd have been before and after. That shit would have been crazy. Yeah, man. No, I don't know nothing about that. Them young girl up. They be coming for you like that. Mama. What, Phelps? Like, it's really like that. No, I and I'm really like, is. I talk shit, I'm flirty, naturally, I'm Aquarius. But right. it's just, I never did it. I, I, I would try, but I'm just, I never did it. On um, February 12th. You Aquarius too. Yeah. I know. You crazy. Aquarius, I feel like all Aquarius is have like talent. I, I said, you think you crazy? Yes, I do. I definitely think you crazy. If nobody else in here is crazy, you crazy. You're not even like loud with it, but you're crazy. Yeah. I used to watch all your stuff. That's, that's like looking at somebody's mind. You think of crazy shit. Yeah, you crazy. Motherfucker had a song about Papa Perks. Now look at Kissington. <laughs> nah, that was bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, what? No, you fucked so Yo, boom, like that shit My homies cool ain't the same. Shit. I swear to God, like it wasn't even taboo back then when that song was out. It was not a taboo thing. I swear to God. This is how you know it was crazy. And I don't even know if we can leave this in. We might got to cut this out. <laughs> Crack. Yeah. That was the thing. Motherfuckers from everywhere, not just Philly. Like, that They're was not crazy. Me. tapping me on my shoulder, I mean, man. It's, 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 it's wild, but 
No, it's what? wild, but let's let's be real. Let's be clear. Nah, it's, it if it wasn't bad. for drugs and drug talk, Future wouldn't even exist. That's his whole catalog. Because that's what we was doing. And we don't even know said. Future eating pills or not. Or not. <laughs> or not. And, and, he, and they say he, he wasn't. <laughs> So who contributed? Yeah. Yeah, don't say that. I, I ain't gonna say contributed. Thank you, Mona. But I will say them niggas down Kissington, they was with the song, they was they had teeth then. It escalated. Niggas was escalated. getting fried. Niggas was getting fried already. I'm but. playing bone. You know I'm playing bone. It's first of all, here at the Don't Come Record Podcast, we do not support opi abuse. If you need Thank some help you. or problem, please call this number down below. And listen, they got shit the wedge. Happens. I went to the wedge program. He went to the wedge. Let's go. I know he not on. I know. Uh, um, some, get off of some real. I don't know punishment. if he got a lot of time for that, but maybe he will fit some of y'all. And I don't want to send a rush because I don't know if y'all know that's like a world problem. That ain't no Philly shit. Motherfuckers is fucked up. Can you tell me something to the people that's always DMing people they think that 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 well that has a lot of followers on Instagram mm-hmm. that like they always DM us asking for money or. Oh my god, <laughs> or, I had that like, conversation a lot. Yeah. Like that shit is a burnout. Well, I think somebody got me, man. They, 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 they DM me and said they was poop papers. Yeah. That poop yeah. ain't yeah. answer for no yeah. poop. Yeah. Nah, yeah. 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 Hey, they, they got me crazy. And, 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 and they like, cool. and, and, and I'm like, I'm like, I just did a song with poop. Yeah. So I'm like, and they How poop. Would you I'm send like, them? I'll send them a bean. He, he like, that's, you know what that's a hundred dollars. Cool up in the in jail too. Yeah. And, I, and I'm like, I said, I think this nigga, I think somebody really just got me, man. What? Who's saying no? That shit go a long way. Yeah, I'm ready to text y'all now. Say it's don't call me white girl. It's don't call me white girl. I know I just seen you, but they spun me on the block. I got I got a bell. I need everybody help. Yeah. And you gonna say fuck that? That bitch will call my phone. I don't believe that. Yeah, that's shit. what I say. Yeah, she would have called me. Oh, you knew Ed wasn't real. Certain niggas. No, I know what. First, he said for the eighty-five dollars. I said the eighty-five dollars. Oh my god! Yeah. And then he started asking me about my hair. I went to Turkey and got my hair done. Oh, you did? I was going to Turkey and get my teeth done. They number one. They number one with hair, and they number one black noses. You smart. That's where you supposed to go. This the first time. Rich, Rich got money. Rich got money. Black noses. A lot of black people get those jobs now, but they specialize in it. Mind you, how the fuck he gonna leave prison to get his motherfucking hair fixed, baby? That's what I'm saying. So when I saw the room, <laughs> and we talked about everything, I they gonna give him a furlough for his hairline. And that's what it is. So anybody want Ab's story is is that your friend? Ab, that's your friend. Or like well, he I, all cool? I met him when I came home. His story is very sad to me. Yeah, Ab was cool. Especially yeah. when, especially when, because you know nowadays, that's why I almost hate TikTok. That's why I almost hate TikTok because they break down looking too much to too much shit. It's like ridiculous. But even with him, they had put together collages of every time he said something federal, and it would be so federal. Remember, some of them went viral, like the one joint when he'd be like, shit, every time this nigga rap, he cause he killed the nigga, cause he got in the studio and after he killed the nigga. Yeah, yeah. That shit. That's viral. I'm giving the bug. Oh my God! Everything he talk about, he, he did do. that shit. Like what the fuck? Yeah, that's what got him in the Ed, yeah. I met Ed before he was Ed. He is a real good dude. I don't real know. Him. Good guy, he seemed man. like a cool dude. My family from 15th Street, so I would see him like around Erie Avenue because you know she fucked everybody. So we'd be sliding door all the neighborhood. She had us lit. He seemed like okay, but I don't know enough to say he a good guy. Yeah, he seemed like a I, nice guy. I, I real good, real good dude. Free him. That story is fucking horrible. But that don't is that really real? Like, is that really true? What? That some of the stuff he said on the internet got him arrested? Like, because, you know, everybody said the Vlad interview. Is that stuff true? No, I think he just was really active on the street. Okay. He, he, it was, it was, he was active. And I think it was more so the niggas, the nigga would tell him. Okay. That was it. Yeah, just niggas was telling. Cool somebody him. told on him. He was cool, but niggas just told on him. Real zats. Yeah. Because they didn't use none of that shit in the trial. Yeah. yeah he was talking about. I don't think. I yeah. think it was just rap. Mm. But it just looks crazy. Though. Cause we can't. Bobby like Smurder. They it's will play bar for bar. It don't matter. Young yeah. Thug. Y'all see what they doing in Thug right now? You yeah. see what they did to Bobby Smurder. But you can't take everybody example and and and, and, and just say it's everybody. Right now, if you have do street activity, in my opinion, mm. you drop niggas, rob niggas, whatever. 
and your dumb ass references in a song, you deserve whatever but you who, get. It's stupid. A lot of, a you lot can of, you can be imaginative and say other shit. You don't have to say, yeah, I dropped a nigga hit on a Toyota and I had the ski mask with the yellow Amiri. Why are we giving it to these like that? I mean, oh, can you not? Can you get that out of there? I did not mean to say that. I just said the c word. And I said. They they is I don't getting say that. stuff like they that. They is getting a little the too camera vivid. Wasn't on. They getting a little bit too. See vivid now they know I said it off camera. Thanks, Rich. You huh? know that's what the movie is all about. What? It's, it's right, about, right. It's, it's, it's about the drill rappers. I think that's funny. Um, just just like how y'all put your business do out too there. much. Yeah. But the part eight, what they known for in the movie is saying what they gonna do mm. and what they say they gonna do and release the video. Twenty four hours is done. Yeah. So that's what they do in the video, and we just we just put it on steroids. But you know I mean, that's that's, that's what what's really going on, on that's right what, now. That's what's going on? Yeah, to, These niggas are really that. doing that right now. Yeah. Yeah, we try to put a mirror on the youth to really try to show them in a comical way. Yeah. Stupid they look. The whole yeah. 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 I'm yeah, telling. See, that's I'm deep. telling everybody. I'm going to kill you tomorrow. And y'all should have said that it. first. Y'all need yeah. to tell people that about this fucking yeah, movie. That's, that's, that's what's going on. The motherfucking yeah. mayor probably would have played it. Like what the fuck? No, yeah. it pops since 1987. Okay. This some real anti ski mask shit. Yeah, yes. Yes. In there, they why said, didn't we start? Yeah. But I gotta be the publicist. Why didn't we start with that? Like, why the I fuck didn't we? Know. You know, you give people attention for the first one thirty. If you could catch them and keep them, you can keep them. But most of the time, motherfuckers get to jerking off. Yeah, reverse that. That yeah. need to be the, because yeah. that's beautiful. Oh, come from a city that we come from, where ten yeah. motherfuckers got shot last night in West Philly and three died. Right. Oh, oh, where a bitch just shot a baby and said "fuck your baby" and walked off like a nigga. Like yeah. that's where we from. So and like that's that's, and, a, that's and, what's and up that's if y'all why doing we that. Really named it y'all drawing about the baby that, drawing. That's bad. Yeah, that was crazy. The, like the girl didn't yo, show the baby or nothing though. That, that's the thing. Oh, they left the baby. They right? left the baby. I don't be like, that's what I'm saying. Was crazy. When the girl turned around, she starts shooting at the dad. The dad take off first. Then the mom says, "What about my baby?" She say, "Fuck your baby." The mom take off. The neighbors come and get the baby, and then they they claim that they, they ran because they had warrants. But it's like my baby. I don't give a fuck about warrant. I'm not leaving my baby. I just want to go to jail. But of course, they couldn't have had no pistols on them. But they, you know what else they said? They owed them a hundred dollars. They both under eighteen. The mom and the dad, and they owe her a hundred dollars. Yeah, but she. Wow, yeah. over a billion I probably wouldn't shot be here now. no more. I don't, this I don't, yo, it's sad ever. times, man. I'm gonna die in front of it or something. Yeah, yeah, run up to the bitch, yeah, try to yeah. Jamie's born this bitch. Yeah, yeah, she gonna run crazy. out of bullets, fucking with me, but yeah. she get and the nigga take off first. Pew. Yeah, yeah. like, the yo. nigga's the first one to run, and then the mom got the nerve to be like, "My baby," like motherfuckers. I mean, if I grow up and seen that. I oh. thought she had the baby and the lady. And so the lady, the baby the lady. made it. The the, la- who was the lady they blurred? Who was the person they blurred it's, out? It's the mom and the dad. The dad runs off from the yeah. door. Mm-hmm. Then the mom is there. The mom and the girl have a back and forth. Mind you, the girl walk, chase him, yeah. shoot at him. Decide she don't want to run and shit. chase him and turn around and come for her. And then when she come for her, the girl say, what about my baby? She say, fuck your baby. And the girl runs. And then the girl walks off and the stroller is alone. That's in Holmesburg. Yeah. And one of the motherfucking neighbors come, get the baby, take the baby to the hospital. And then the parents call and say, we were scared about our warrants. But I guess because they under 18, they going to take that. Because if they was grown, they would charge them for that. Yeah, if I was the, the baby and I grew up, and I <laughs> if I was the baby, it's crazy. I, if really I was like, the baby, it's so crazy, it. bro. Like, I if baby. I was the baby, no, my dad is a turkey. Out of that whole story, my if I was the baby, burger, and they broke and shit, they over. Yeah. I got shot over a baby. <laughs> 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 over a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting adopted. Yo. I don't want to be in this house, this family. They, Yo. My dad is turkey yeah. burger. And, and, and they broke, he and they, fucked me up with if I was the baby, because who would have thought? That's nasty word. It's crazy. Running over a beanie seagull is crazy. I mean, no, but it's, no, 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 no I, but she got the pistol no, out. They knew she they was, was going to shoot. Pi- no, let's wait a minute. We got to make it clear. She was playing the pistol like, y'all don't got my hundred dollars, you gonna suffer for it now. I'm not about to see oh, y'all wow. later. She was but shooting niggas. Let's that's get this. what Boone said. You yeah. had to kill me. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you I'm not gonna leave my baby. Yeah, let's Fuck get this clear. I'm not leaving my baby. You got a black woman, a black woman pulled out a gun. Yeah. That's dangerous. 
<laughs> that's very dangerous. That, I'm talking about in broad daylight. And she clearly and like, she a stud, like a stud, like a hard, no. like a hard, like a. I watch a lot what? of movies, so I know technical. You could have things that do. I could have flipped that motherfucker. I'd have hit the bitch quit. in the nose with my you mom. Quit. Like, Ugh. I'm quick I with it. I'm quick I with it. I'm quick with it. You know what I mean? You might think you're getting me, but yeah. No. All jokes aside. All jokes aside. Me, you, and me, me, Tom, and Phelps, we'd have dropped that bitch. If it was me, Tom, and Phelps, we'd have dropped that bitch. That girl, she looked like. How the fuck that bitch up? She gave him her back. She gave him her back. Bro, she, first of all, it wasn't no switch. It wasn't no. You feel me? Like, really, what she. Exactly. That bitch gave niggas her back. I'm gonna kick you in your fucking back. You can't give me your back with no strap. You're not gonna turn your back on me. And you got hair the way I grabbed this motherfucker. We, we definitely would have handled that situation right there. We'd have had to. I'm not saying I wouldn't get shot. I'm not even saying I'm gonna die. But me and that bitch. No, it ain't. Me and that bitch going, we gonna tussle. You can tussle, put in the yo. You can't. You can't. Yeah. You don't know. She don't got no switch on this True. Driver. You don't. But you also do know. Oh, that, I think that is the same motherfucker you just changed an hour ago and this nigga's still on Holmesburg and Ashland and you three blocks up. That's crazy to me. Yeah. They don't even come back. I can even see if it was like they came wow. back, took the baby's house. They took the fuck off. Fuck that you. Boy. You done. You ain't gonna yeah. no survive that. I'm out. Yeah, like, that what boy. the fuck? $100, if they said drug that. And they're under 18. Yeah, that explains. Like, okay. Yeah, that's crazy. The whole movie about the y'all drawing. Yeah. Like a lot of people, like, they just think this is fully slang. But it's y'all drawing. It's a message. Yeah. Like, y'all people. tripping. It's a message to the people. You know what's so funny? That's Some of y'all are watching this at home and you're probably like, what the fuck does that mean? Yeah. Oh yeah, my man. God. Drawing is a, um, a slang word of Philadelphia. You know what's so funny? You know what I remember about drawing? It had just came out with my mom, Mooney, Delaware. Yeah. I remember that because when I came here saying it, they'd be like, what? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Mm-hmm. They don't, they never said none of it. So when you hear people say it here, it's from us. You feel know I me? Mean? Yeah. That's our lingo. That's not theirs. Yeah. They, they got on that years after. Right. That's, that's, yeah. that's a fact. In the beginning of the movie, we break down the definition. Okay. So before we do that, explain what drawing means. What drawing means? Somebody drawing, what that mean? They got the one. They some wild stuff. They don't, they don't too much. South Philly Town said out of pocket. Another Philadelphia word. Out of pocket. You can't use the Philly definition right. with a Philly it's, definition. It's, it's, they doing the most. Like the most outrageous stuff. And that's another Philly word. We need a regular yeah, black yeah. and white word. Yeah. We need it for the bitches in Idaho. Idaho. Okay? Yeah. Can somebody spit it out like Bring that? Bring unwanted attention to any situation yeah. okay. that occurs. Okay. okay. Here we go. That's what it say. Okay. But it's really like a See, you killed it. You cheated. I didn't even know they had this little spot. I never saw that part. Oh, shit. I never saw that part. We really in tune as a team. Yeah, we in tune. Yeah. I'm getting a prom gown made. Yeah. yeah, t- yeah. Demona Bassett. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get a nice gown made. But y'all drawing is just a message. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You got a message to the city. Yup. You like a lot of hair. You wanna yeah. wear a suit? You got yeah, I wear a suit. Let's just deck, let's just get fucking decked out. I ain't gonna lie, you Richard got... don't got money, they'll pay for our stuff. Facts. Facts. <laughs> Facts. Facts. Yeah, y'all Facts. Really are, y'all I ain't gonna lie, they treat us. They treat us good. I wanna get suited in Y'all weren't y'all really wanna get suited in booty. They treat us good. And I don't even talk like that, do I, Tom? I don't even talk like that. I think it's worth that. It's a big deal. It's a big so deal. So you think I really got to go on a couch? I think it would be nice. Even if you don't go like too crazy. Because I ain't really want the people. Because it's the movie. The people can do what they want. We're in it. Okay. They can do what the fuck they want. All right. I just feel like it should be it should be suit and tie. I like, I like colors. Yeah. Colors. So let's go colors. formal. Listen. No, listen, let's not do black. Let's, whatever she said. Listen, let's so not you do black. So you going to come to the premiere? Yeah, I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay, whatever she said. Let's not do, we're not doing um, like family reunion, funeral, Janazza Memorial. We're not Fly. matching. It's just going to call formal. Now, if Fly. you if you have to do sneaks with your little suit, fine. It's not like you can't get in, but we're going to be formally dressed. Here we go. Because we're in the uh, fucking movie. We're in the movie. Yeah. 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 It, it's done. So you can go up, up, or down, down. You don't have to so be crazy. Best dress, best dress, best dress, cash, $500. Oh, now that's nice. Yeah. Best, best, best dress, cash, $500. Nice. Yeah. 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 Best dress, $500. 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 Yeah. 
Because you don't, it doesn't, it's the premiere. Is it what you, you want? You're coming as yourself, best with your best, people. You like that? Best what? dress, 500 Yeah, that's nice. And a cent would be no, nice. Best dress yeah. Thousand? A okay. band, yeah. A thousand. Yeah. That's a dollar. Between five hundred and a band. A thousand. Yeah. He's gonna wear he's formal wear. Formal wear. And grease on his lips. He's that's not gonna be at work. He's not gonna be at work. He's gonna be what's called it. Yeah. We're gonna have to do the whole thing. We might even need somebody to host the red carpet. Because we're doing we gotta do the whole they thing. They told us we couldn't handle red carpet. Oh, they said no. We can do somewhere else. We can do something outside. No, we can go outside. We can do it outside. Or even if we did it somewhere else, it don't matter. We need no, we can do it. We can do it outside the building, right there. Because all it is is a red carpet, lights, and the camera crew. That's all it is. And somebody with a mic to say, hey, how you doing? You excited about the night? They just get to walk in. That's it. And then they get the crowd walking in, and that's it. It's not that much. There we go. Because you said it, we won't make it happen. You smart guy. That's crazy. Yeah, I knew you was smart. Especially if you going to come in your prime dress. We got to get a red yeah, carpet. Yeah, because I ain't get black the, I carpet. Go what to you prime? want? Red or black carpet? Red. That's traditional, Can, can right? I bring back the linen sets? You can wear Remember linen set. we used to go bring the... We used you to wear, wear the linen, linen set, set at, at a gray You prime. can wear a linen set. You can go do you can even wear the barbecue, Uncle hard. Barbecue sandals. With I can the wear. All right, say less. Say less. Say less. Ain't no pressure on it, so don't say stress less. out about it. But just say try less. to keep it formal. Okay. Okay. There you go. And bring a date. Bring a bitch. Put her titties mm-hmm. up. That's just automatic. Bring you a bitch. That's oh, that's lit. Somebody should go with you. Yeah. So you are gonna be walking like this? Yeah. That's good. I like that. That's even better. Poly, yeah, the poly life. Listen, if we gave you a lot of information. We're gonna put the trailer at the end of the podcast. Um, I really appreciate you niggas coming, man. Um, Jew, it's this is special because I feel like we've been so for so long. You've been my nigga forever. Um, and I'm proud of you. I'm proud of me. I'm proud of us, babe. For you as well. You know, you locked in with my cousin Tom. So yeah, that's you know, that's it. you know, oh, yeah, Tom. Yourself, really niggas, really. We from we from the projects. I be forgetting. I forget. Um, and Boom and Rich, thank y'all so much for the opportunity. Uh, no problem. I really do. Uh, thank you. You know what I mean? Right. I didn't yeah, know y'all know who I was. Yeah, and really, you know yes, yeah, like doing being the thing. best and just being just killing my role, man. Yeah. Not real rap. God, I almost locked the nigga up yesterday. I had to like the morning stop. It's over. It was just a movie. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just embracing the whole Philadelphia, the culture. Yeah. Like, I, 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 don't, I don't think you understand how much you think that you we got doing, that doing. Do you doing that in the blue group? It's my thing. You know, yeah. You how much mm-hmm. you're going for the Philadelphia culture as a whole. Mm-hmm. But you really doing a hell of a lot right now. Thank you. We try to bring them together, and you wrap your audience and your platform and just your genuine love around the whole project. It's really taking it to another plateau. And oh, I really man. appreciate that. You're really doing a whole lot. I think we got a Lee Daniels shot out of here. I know that's my nigga. Uh, I gotta tell you about that. That's my nigga. Phelps, Phelps was you know he was you know it was a lot of us here. We kind of heavy. He stepped to the side. Shout out to Phelps, man. Right. Shout out to Phelps. Shout out to Phelps, man. Who's gonna come in the camera? Come in the camera. Shout out to Phelps, man. Come in the camera, bro. We love Phelps, man. Come on, Tom. You too, Tom. Come on. Come on, Tom. Oh, yeah, Say cheese, Tom. Wild. He got wild. his young gun that. hat on. He's, He's a humble guy. Man. Shout out to old Bro. Philly, yeah. Jersey. Yo, let's get it. Yep. But Mona, like, whatever. In the future, moving forward, anything, like, just you going to regret saying that. All right. <laughs> Uh, I just I'll be on your line in a month. Uh, 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 Mona, the bit too. What you? When he came yeah, to I'm the, with it. To I'm with thing. it. To the movie. That was real, the I'm with it. Y'all, y'all do? Y'all got it in there? Yes, I'm with it. I'm doing it. I don't care what we got to do. I'm doing it. Y'all know y'all let my um a friend of mine here podcast and a comedian too. His name is Derek. Uh, we call him Conehead on the show. His name is America's Nightmare. On um, Instagram, but he came in and then we was doing like the cop scene. And I think y'all let him walk on. He was hype as shit. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's why oh, I was yeah, so yeah. lit, though. It was, it was. But listen, make sure y'all check everything out. All information, um, August 16th, you can see it in the theaters. It should be out, able to stream. You're going to know because I'll post it when it is available for stream. I'll post the link. You can just press it. Um, thanks for tuning in, checking with everybody. Everybody's Instagram name is going to be down here. Support, follow everybody, show love. We appreciate y'all. And watch um, A Thousand Kids. 
movies on Netflix so we can talk about next week. Yes, sir. Love y'all. Love my cousins. I see y'all right and I love y'all. I love y'all so much. This summer. I don't know about this. I ain't doing no follow. Stay back here. Hey, yep. Ops. Meatball. Pull the phone out. Let's go live. Say your last one. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Oh. Man, I didn't want to die. Man, I got this. Oh. The park eight. They got switches on them pistols. I'm gonna sit my fan in the car. The carjacking you and your girlfriend experience was committed by the members of a gang called the Party. Pussy was the big deal. They tried to take his car, he got his car back. There's no crime committed. I don't know where Mr. Maurice lives at. You did. You are gone. When they put a video out, everything comes to life within the next 24 hours. Young boy, I'm not playing with you. Now go ahead. Go ahead. It's war time! Yo, what's up with you? My ex in Yo, what? Did y'all get us? Are you telling? Cause I got shit to Yeah, that's what I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell. Slapping old people. Uh -huh. Stealing Frenchy puppies. You willing to testify? I'm testifying now. Y'all draw August 16th. Hey.